I think the thing that I like about riding the most is just finding a really cool, interesting feature, making something out of nothing and putting my own spin on it. I found this falling down tree a little while ago and it just looked like there were a couple of different possibilities. So yeah, today we're out in the woods. I've actually brought a spade for once, unusual for me, I know. Uh, we're gonna try, see what we can build on it. And that's just it really. I'm as interested to see what we can make out of this as anybody. So yeah, we're just gonna have a little flash around, move some stones around, do a little bit of digging, have a roll at it. Like I'm almost wanna work back from it. Basically where I wanna end up on the bike is like up here somewhere, like looking cool-ish. I think first things first, I'm gonna build some sort of transition here and then work my way back. Cool. Yeah, I think something like that. If at any point this looks like I know what I'm doing, completely not. All of a sudden it looks completely different. <laughs> I think that's sort of where it needs to be on that top bit there. I think it just needs like some dirt on it now to tie it together a bit. We're getting a bit of a basic shape on. Um, I'm not sure it's the right shape, but um, give it a roll, I think. Oh, this looks horrendous. Whoa. <laughs> oh man, that does not work how I thought it was gonna do. Not gonna lie, I think it needs an adjustment. <laughs> um, we're adjusting at this point. This is the fun of it, oh, you know, you just, you see something, you just, you have like a vision, you're at where you want to be eventually, and then work back from that point. And I'm working back. This is why I ride rocks. Less than, uh, less than ideal conditions, I must say. Better. Uh, hmm. Maybe I just put some rocks into it or something. They're not going to move, are they? Problem is, that's a quad mire. You only need to be able to make it nearly rideable. Mm, bugger! It was something. <laughs> I'm not sure what happened from there to there, but something cool happened, I think. It felt pretty exciting. That was fun. Whoa. <laughs> I felt good. Yeah, I think I'm happy with that. I think I'm happy with that. So we're going to leave that one for today, I think. Um, but I have just found another little idea here as well. So I'm thinking that if I build a little kicker here, come across here, hit a little kicker, do some sort of turny type thing in the air, land coming back towards me, Turn in the air, coming back across. Could be quite cool, a bit exciting. Give it a go. I'll be going round this rock. Oh my word. Another acreage special. Nothing lines up. <laughs> so then, under here, for all this probably slip a pedal on that. 
I'm not massively uh, buzzed enough trying this first go, I must admit. Give it a roll. <laughs> committed. <laughs> I don't know what happened there, I thought that were it. It's a really hard pedal to get any form of speed across this floor. I'm just sprinting towards a wall. <laughs> yeah, I'm happy with that. Super happy with that. And it feels mint, like you're just going into it and it's just like you're pulling, but yeah, I just hit it so hard. It feels cool. Yeah. Psyched. Yeah, so one of my ideas were a little kick or two, little nose thing back in. Seems plausible. <laughs> Template. Well, that's the first time I've actually looked at it from up here and it's, uh, it looks different all of a sudden. That's heavy. Definitely pushing the boundary a little bit what I can do on this tree, I think, today. Until you see a bit of dirt on it, it's really hard for me to vision it because I'm just not used to building this sort of stuff. As you can see, I'm not really a trail builder. <laughs> uh, yeah. Quick sandwich. We're getting to the exciting point now. The only thing left to do is give it a little roll and see what she's saying. Every time I'm coming in, I'm coming in as fast as I possibly can. And every time I hit this patch here, it's just slowing me right down. So I've just sort of cobbled it a little bit with some little stones. Hoping I can get some speed for the transition, because at the moment, it's looking like a no-go. <laughs> So I've been banging away at this for a little while and I just, I've just not even had one that's close. Sometimes it just works like that. So I can't leave the spot without something. So we're going to change tack. Maybe try like an abubica, which I haven't probably done for 10 years. Try that, cause that'll be a laugh. Kicking my ass. Ah, oh, robbed. <laughs> I think that's what they call ringing your bell. Even with like stones, and it's just sinking so far down. I'm not sure. <laughs> okay. What can you do? I'm really trying here. <laughs> really trying. Right. Oh yeah! <laughs> so that's pretty much it. Um, feel like I've really maximised the spot today. Um, I've definitely not got any more in me. I've had one hell of a battle today. When you land it, it just feels like the best thing ever. You know, it's, it's definitely worth putting the effort in to like land a trick. And even if it's like, it doesn't look amazing on camera, it just feels pretty cool to ride away from something, you know, something that you've built and like, you know, even if it's like <laughs> really badly built, like I built it. I can go, I'm happy today. I feel, yeah, put some good, good stuff together, I feel.